Meanwhile, visiting French President Emmanuel Macron has met Ethiopian President Saleh Workzude and Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed. They discuss issues of cooperation between the two countries in areas of military, trade and investment. President Macron has reiterated France's full support to Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed's efforts. CGTN's Gerum Chala has more. French President Emmanuel Macron first met President Abiy Ahmed in the Ethiopian historic city of Lalibela. There, both have visited the Lalibela Rokeon Church. France had provided support for works of conservation to be done on this World Heritage Site. After returning to Addis and at the office of the Prime Minister, Abiy and Macron saw the signing of four agreements on military, trade and investment cooperation. Based on the agreement on military cooperation, France will back Ethiopia to modernize its ground and air forces as well as re-establish its navy. Due to the fragile security situation in our region, Ethiopia wants to build an even stronger defense force and we especially want to work with the French government to build a strong air force and a strong navy in this country. President Macron and I have overseen the cooperation agreement between our two defense ministries in this regard. This can be taken as one of the boldest bilateral ties Ethiopia has with EU states. Our agreement on military cooperation focuses on re-establishing and strengthening Ethiopia's navy, and it also advances to strengthening the air and ground forces of the country. We will provide material and training assistance to deliver our promises. We give this great attention. The joint work between our two defense forces is vital. This is because we have a huge respect for Ethiopia's engagement in the region on peacekeeping and tackling terrorism. On the political aspects of their relations, France Emmanuel Macron said him and his government are happy with Ethiopia's current journey to a democratic state. Macron has expressed his full support for Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed's leadership. Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed, on his part, has made an appeal for President Macron. Abiy asked looted African wealth now in European banks to be repatriated to the continent through the help of France and its administration. Later at night, President Macron has met Ethiopia's President Sahalo Zode and held talks on issues of mutual concern. France has granted Ethiopia 15 million euros for works of capacity building and gave 85 million euros as a concessional loan. Ethiopia and France have a long-standing historic relations and currently the two strategic partners are cooperating in almost all sectors. Giant French companies are already investing in Ethiopia, especially on sectors like breweries. More investment is expected following the visit of President Emmanuel Macron to Ethiopia. Group Jala CGTN, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.